and welcome back to my mom's channel say it say hello and welcome back to mom's channel i am ella and i am one year old and i love my life Welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a long time, but today we are going to get into my morning routine thing, my Sunday reset routine. And today on the agenda, we have making our bed, clipping my daughter's Ella's nails, giving her a shower, taking a shower, doing my post shower routine, and also my skincare. What you see right now, it's my skincare and hair care done but we're gonna rewind and do all of those things and talk to you later so Dani, what are we doing today we are cutting Ella's nails then then we are showering her then we are giving her a shower yes showering ourselves showering her what's your name i what's so happy man i'm no, i Sorry, sorry. Ulta oral. Cut the. Okay, look. No, I'm not fake. Dia. Scam. Hehe. Hehe. This will torture her. A lot. Shower routine. Guys, that is it for today's video. No, it's Thank not. you for watching. We have done nail cutting routine. Edit karegi tu. Koshish karu ka. Das saal mein to aayi jayegi. Hey, hey. She did not do that. I, she did. She did not. She did. You guys saw it. She did not do that. She do it. She do it. She do it. Guys, this is Momo. This is Dumpling. Mote ho gaye dono. Meitra. Ye dekho. Indre. Indrayani. Indrayani, guys. Very nice. And it's for. Itna kyu aage kar diya? Aapka dimag sadka hua hai kya? Guys, bed sheet pudding hack 101. Beetle. Playing our best friends when they are hanging out. Do you want to go on the height difference? Guess I didn't hear any good. I'm not sure what I'm doing. 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 Okay, so Ella has showered. She has clearly struggled with it. It's okay, baby girl. It's okay, baby girl. Yeah, I know. Oh, shush. Ew, it's with the water. Let me rinse you off, baby. Okay, 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 go out there. So, it's not great, but it is necessary. So, I just took a shower and I have some mask on, on my hair. And I'm just gonna let that sit for 25 minutes. But my face feels a little dry. So, I like to put on this mask. It just sort of exfoliates my skin into feeling better, into looking better. It's like this. <laughs> so I'm just gonna apply it because I don't have a mirror in front of me right now and I'm just gonna go back. I'm done with that bit. If you're wondering why this, I left this part of my area uncovered, this part of my area, it's because um, I have some sort of an active, sort of an acne situation near my eyebrow. It's sort of a mess, but the clay mask proved to be pretty good for me for the past six 
ish months my active breakouts are very less especially on my face plus it has a waiting time for about 20 to 25 minutes which is also the same case for my mask so it works out pretty well i don't want to keep talking for 25 minutes so i'm just gonna see you after i wash my face and my hair so the first thing that i do is oh my god the first thing that i do is put on this skin toner it's not focusing okay anyway it's a skin toner it's a cucumber based skin toner by jovi uh, i've been using this for the past 4 years and it's been a blessing because it's very cooling and my skin feels very dry after i've washed it or cleaned it so i like to just I like to sit like that sit in meanwhile i do my post shower routine today i'm using this body oil this it's not it's not really for coco body butter and this foot cream by oriflame the significance of this routine what uh putting on a body oil before you put on a body butter does is that it doesn't dry your skin out eventually i find people always complaining about never finding the correct lotion but truly if i'm being honest in all my 22 years of existence my mom has asked me to put on oil in the morning and i used to hate it because of its oily texture but now i found the perfect hack you put on the oil and then you put on the body butter the oil gets absorbed into the skin and the body butter since it's moisturizing it moisturizes and it also stops your body skin from looking oily so it works perfectly for me so i'm just going to put that and come back now that i've thrown on some clothes i can finally be at peace and not be nervous about people listening in my toner is completely gone i mean not gone it's been absorbed by my skin So now I like to go in with Pilgrim ka Alpha Arbutin and Vitamin C serum. I am using this one as a trial product since it's small and I swatch tested it it was fine. You're just supposed to put 2 3 drops directly on your skin and you're not supposed to massage it. So I just go in like this spreading it out. small taps and it's supposed to go all over your neck as well since it's like a sudden day reset i sort of need to exfoliate my skin and make it feel better and work on my acne scars which have gone down then i use a niacinamide ordinary serum again three drops of it are enough You can massage this one. Well, after niacinamide, my skin feels a little bit sticky, so I'd like to go in with my spot corrector. It's Just Herbs, and it's called a Blemmy Gel. It works for me. So then I go in with the Sheer Matte Day Cream because I have a combination skin, and as of right now, it's very oily. Like I have. both kinds of moisturizers that work for oily skin that work for dry skin depends on the kind of day i'm having kind of weather it is it's quite humid outside so my skin tends to get a little oily this cream i've been using it for a while i have a smaller version of it now like just it's so dry it's it's just it's perfect when you're having an oily sort of a day then i go in with a uh, non sticky moisturizer a very good moisturizer and it doesn't stay on your face even after a day cream thing it's not sticky at all and it makes you feel like a glazed donut my my sunscreen so you're supposed to put on three fingers worth but it is three fingers worth you can see how much product there is and i apply it Reapply it every two to three hours, but I like to go in with this Naked and Raw Coffee and Lip Balm, Coffee Lip Balm, because I used a coffee choco butter, body butter. I don't know what I'm saying at this point yet, and it leaves my lips looking fresh as ever. 
Let it be hold on camera. And when I've done all of this, I just sort of air dry my hair. Then I have three things to work with. And First, I like to go in with the anti frizz, anti breakage, anti dryness serum by Extenso Care by L'Oreal. A very tiny drop of it. Like, I don't know if you can see it, but it's very little and it goes a long way, guys. Like, and then I just start putting it all over my lens. And this is an argan oil serum by Pilgrim and it's working great for my hair since my scalp has been so healthy I haven't had a dandruff problem since I've been using it. it goes on your, this oil goes on your scalp and my hair is like mildly dry so it just works. You give yourself a massage there and you're done. Finally and lastly I like to go in with this Plum Coconut and Squalene Nutri Shine Hair Serum. It's blue, so it looks and it controls frizz, smoothens, and adds a, adds a glossy shine. Again, you use a very small pump of it and you spread it across your hand and you use it exactly like you use the extensive care thing. That's about my team. I'm gonna roll back in once I'm done. See ya! So, now that my hair is dry, it's feeling clean, it's feeling fresh, it's feeling very hydrated. And as of right now, it looks frizzy, but it's really not as frizzy as you might think. It's just the Mumbai weather, but it'll be fine tomorrow. And yeah, that's it for the video. Thank you for watching, thank you for following because uh, the last video I made was for 1k and I know it's been a while but I'm glad you guys followed me. And if you're watching this video right now, please give it a like, share, thumbs up, whatever you guys want to. And thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time.